Hello everyone! Welcome to night two of Vlogica, where I vlog the eight nights of Hanukkah from here in Japan. Manichan got a new toy box this morning for Christmas. Yeah. It's Splatoon. Let's go get some sushi! This is our favorite sushi place, and it used to be like regular just kaiten sushi, but now it is just um, like it's all order, so you just order from this menu thing. And it comes right to your table. And you can even send it back by pressing the button on the panel too. So it's all order made. Um, it's no longer the revolving conveyor belt thing. salad. It's like a Caesar salad with like ham and tomato, cheese, croutons, egg, dressing. Oh, it doesn't seem to be very popular here. I'll give it a chance. That's an egg under that cheesy stuff? Yeah. I didn't realize there was an egg. I was just kind of wanting something fresh. So I hope that you guys are having a Merry Christmas. We are here getting Christmas sushi because that's the thing. We had a very nice Christmas morning. It was pretty awesome. And now we're just uh, having our Christmas sushi. And I think we're going to go to the adjacent mall and pick up some stuff. Uh, they're the only place that I can really find pie crusts, which aren't even pie crusts. They're more like tort things. So I'm going to pick those up so I can make pumpkin pie and kid is screaming. So, see you later. I'm so tired. I couldn't sleep last night. I think I was excited for Christmas. But it was pretty epic. And this morning, my sweetie got me, um, he like pre-ordered for me a stabilizer for the iPhone. So the iPhone videos will be much better as soon as that comes. And uh, I'm so excited for it. And it even works as a charger, so oh, it's gonna be awesome. I can't wait. And thank you, Jason. You're welcome. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Oh. <laughs> Are you having a nice Christmas? I am, absolutely. Great Christmas. Go ahead. Relax. <laughs> we have this hot big taco thing at Starbucks. Uh, these are both sold out. I want to try this. We are caffeinating. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I didn't get a Starbucks cup. Oh my god, the rage. I am hashtag triggered. Yeah, so Christmas blend, and this is all I can handle because I'm used to tea most of the time. So only this amount of caffeine. my channel. Um, Scuba is famous for lots of sciencey things including Cyberdyne and there is actually a Cyberdyne here like this is for real like you can look it up. Um, this is their little studio though so the company is by the station uh, but they develop kind of mobility enhancing um, suits that you can wear so it's especially good for for example, the elderly who are maybe not mobile anymore or people dealing with paralysis. God, he's everywhere now. And pineapple, apple pen. Mm -hmm. If we weren't insanely full right now, we might partake. 
which is Beard Papa. And they have the best cream puffs. Me? Behold. Cyberdyne. We live kind of close to Cyberdyne, so if shit goes down, we'll be the first ones to go. So you'll know. Yeah. Oh my goodness. What are these energy drinks? It's coffee. That's so cute. These are hot. Green blue. Ouch. Extreme blend. So, will I give you the force? That's so cute. Mm. I get coffee at Family Mart now. It's 7 Eleven too, but not much a lot here, so it's really good. I'm gonna try it sometime. They have this self checkout station over here, but nobody wants to use it. They're like too scared. I guess you can use it for regular items too. You can turn the lights on already. This is Kenku Gakuen Station. So, Scuba has all these science research centers and whatnot, and so that's why there's all this scientific stuff. And animals, too, because there's like this geological uh, museum that has dinosaur bones. And yeah, that one looks really pretty at night. Instead of telephone booths, we have these mobility robot sharing system where you can charge your winglet. Yeah. I'll try these things. They look kind of like cyclists. This sign says that it's a robot testing area for those winglets. So watch out for robots. Oh my goodness. Hi. Hi, Mina. That's it. She's so happy. She missed you. <laughs> You're so happy. Thank you. Too. More please. We are back and I am exhausted. I don't know why. I had that huge coffee and I'm still exhausted. So all I want to do is change into that onesie and um, read my new book. So I thought that Jason was the Leslie Nope of gift giving already and then this morning he gave me this. And Leslie Nope is the main character in Parks and Rec, and she is known for her um, gift-giving skills. So I am so excited to read this. It's going to be so much fun. It's going to be so funny. So I think we're going to do that and relax until it is time for Hanukkah and Dinar and all that good stuff. Here we go with night two. And if I had done these vlogs right, it would be like from this night to like the next night. So. This should be the beginning of vlog two, but what are you gonna do? Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam Asher kadoshamu b'mitzvotav v'tivanu l'hadlik ner Shal Hanukkah Eek <laughs> Okay, I think we got it Light two Yeah Happy Hanukkah! Time for Happy presents! <laughs> I got you guilt! I got you Star Wars guilt! <laughs> wow, this is... This is probably the coolest Gelt I have ever received, <laughs> I have to say. Look at that. So Gelt is just candy money, and it's a very common Hanukkah gift. So but it's shiny. So cool, yeah. Growing up, everybody used to be like, oh my god, Hanukkah, eight nights, you get presents for eight nights, oh my god. But usually it's like, you get like one or two big presents, um, unless you're like super rich, which most people are not. Uh, but, you know, other times it would be like a notebook or some pencils or something really little. So, guilt was a pretty big gift growing up. Whoa! Oh! Little baby. Cool! What's in it? Ah, cookies! So it's cookies. kind of a, oh a Star Wars themed, and like the bag is Star Wars too. It says, Merry Force be with you. Mm. And stuff mm -hmm. And then there's the BB-8 cookies. <laughs> and then the Hanukkah guilt. Do you like BB-8, my new chan? <laughs> no? She wants her present. <laughs> <laughs> Here's my present from Jason. Marnia, are you gonna help me? Are you gonna help me? Oh my goodness. Need leverage. Need leverage, Manicha. Yeah. Jeez, you got the shit out of this. <laughs> Oh. Oh. The chocolate. 
Oh, let me eat the shit out of this. Velvet milk, bean to bar. Oh, pretty fancy. Yay. Let's give Mana Chan a gift. So I didn't wrap all of her presents individually. I just put the rest of them in here because it would have taken forever. <gasps> a crinkly bee! Oh <laughs> my goodness! She loves things that crinkle. <laughs> and it squeaks! Oh, she's wagging her tail. Hey guys, I wanted to do more today, but I am exhausted and I have a pretty bad headache So I think I am going to show you some awesome hidden gems and then curl up in this onesie and fall asleep while reading My new Pawnee book and snuggling up to my sweetie um, The first hidden gem that I have for tonight is Tokyo Bree Bree. She is awesome uh, I had the pleasure of meeting her earlier this year, and I hope that we can hang out some more um, but it, it is hard living outside of Tokyo to meet up but um, yeah I hope to see you soon Brittany and I love her channel she's kind of sort of doing vlogmas I think she was doing like the 12 days of Christmas but um, she she's great on Instagram like she is kind of an Instagram queen and her channel is proving to be quite awesome as well and she's got a good, lot of good stuff about Japan and a lot of good story time stuff so please be sure to check her out my second hidden gem is on Twitter, uh, which is kind of the hub to find all of his other stuff. He is a radio personality, he is wonderful, and he is the reason why I was able to go to the Tokyo Game Show this year. Uh, that is Matt Medics. Uh, he is a wonderful human being, he is so positive, he has so much energy, and he is very knowledgeable. Um, he's kind of a jack of all trades, he has information about anything you might want to know. Um, and he is a great personality. I could listen to him all day. So please check out Matt Medics on Twitter and that will uh, help you find his other stuff as well. I'm sorry this hasn't been a very epic Christmas, but um, now you guys know what it's like to be Jewish. Usually we just watch movies and order Chinese food. If I wake up later today, I might get on Twitch, so you can catch me at twitch.tv slash Jenny Silver. But if not, I want to wish you guys a very Merry Christmas and a very Happy Hanukkah and a very Merry whatever else you may be celebrating, even if that is nothing at all. So I will see you tomorrow for night three of Vlogica. Merry Christmas!